working on this infernal thing too much. Just come on over. Suppose I have time for a nap before we leave? Hmm? Well, hello. Was hoping you'd drop by. The worst part of space travel is having to eat alone. I used to eat with my better half every meal until he passed. I've got plenty. I hope you're hungry. Time. Time's what happened. He led a rich, full life. I used to tell my kids that life is a sexually transmitted disease that's 100% fatal. They hated it when I said that. <laughs> I agree. I meet people every chance I get. I finally retired last year, and I've been traveling all over. I wish I could have done this when I was younger, but it's still a treat. My grandkids are mortified that I'm out here. Positively livid. <laughs> you wouldn't believe the characters I've encountered. I invited this one fellow over for a meal, like yourself. So he boards the ship, stark naked. Ha! Ah! Turns out he was one of them old-style nudists. He said, in space, no one ever knew. But Lord knows I noticed. Oh, they're scattered all over. But now, I get to see them all the time. So, what do you think of the settled systems? I can't believe there are so many stars, planets, moons, and whatnot. It makes my head spin just thinking of it. Well, aren't you the most precious thing? I'm doing pretty good. But the expenses do add up. But I won't let you leave empty-handed. Take this. And please do tell what do you think of the settled systems. Ain't that the truth? I'm afraid I'm worn out, dear heart. I'm at the tail end of a very long day. But feel free to grab some extra food or whatnot. I've got plenty. <laughs> 